Hello, and um, this video is for Beer Hunter, if that's how you pronounce it, since he wanted a tutorial on how I knock my pins down on my Minecraft bowling alley. So, this is basically it. And let me show you. But there are a lot of limitations now because um, inside patch one. Point six point five, you can no longer put redstone on TNT, and if you're wondering, this purple stuff is redstone, and um, here, um, uh, I'll work that out later. <laughs> I just installed it, and I really don't care about it. So let's just go to different bowling alley. Okay, basically what you do with the redstone is, um, what I did, ah, crap, better not destroy that. This, um, redstone right here, redstone is underneath these wooden pressure plates right here, these, and you connect the redstone to the, um, TNT like this. See, so now when you power that redstone, the redstone will go to the TNT there. So let me, um, let me see if I can get out of here. And see, once you power that TNT, when something steps on that pressure plate, the TNT will go down, as you can see, because um, TNT obeys gravity. And oh, huh. I did something there. But um, anyway, and what I do is, um, this is sand. I usually put sand, and I remade grapple into that on my texture pack, basically. And since they all obey gravity, crap <laughs> they all obey gravity so when you power the TNT the TNT will fall and so will the pins and that's basically it just this redstone oh that redstone there just um and each of these um, wooden pressure plates go to different things of redstone to power different TNTs so then different blocks will fall and that's how it um, keeps the game without it being unfair, basically. But um, now I don't think it's possible to get a strike anymore because you can't put redstone on um, TNT. So that's basically it. Oh, well. as you can see on this one. This one, these two pressure plates activate this redstone, and all that redstone around just activated all that TNT right here. TNT, and yeah, so basically it. And that's how I got all my um, pins to fall down. And what I did is throughout each alley, I set up different things for redstone, different paths for each different pressure plate, so then different things would fall. So then you don't pressure the same pressure plate over again and try to get the same score. You know, just keep it fair and um that's um basically it. <laughs>